Hi, my name is John Bosworth. I'm a licensed mental health counselor in St. Pete, Florida. I want to talk a little bit about the causes of ADD or ADHD in children. Researchers and mental health and medical professionals are still really not sure, or exactly sure, why some people develop ADD or ADHD. We're, we're starting to see a genetic link, meaning it might be more, there might be more prone in some families. So there might be a tendency to inherit you know, a gene or a genetic tendency to have attention deficit problems. But we do know that um, ADHD is caused by changes in the brain chemistry or in chemicals in the brain. And we know that neurotransmitters are probably responsible for most of that, that chemical reaction. Um, and researchers have isolated probably dopamine, maybe serotonin, maybe some other, other chemicals. But we know that dopamine is responsible for some attention and some attention regularities or regulation areas of the brain. So some of the causes of ADD might be chemical. Some of them might be inherited. And if we can isolate that further, we might find better medications or better ways to prevent ADD from actually occurring. But without actually getting inside a brain before and after, we won't know for sure. So we're going to have to try to do a lot of what's called, uh, you know, rule out by exclusion, find things that really aren't causing it to maybe pinpoint more um, towards some of the things that actually are causing it. So in summary, we want to look at genetics, probably play a role. Uh, most people with ADD probably inherit the tendency or the predisposition toward that, and neurotransmitter, specifically dopamine, might be responsible for some of the attention regularity problems that people have with ADD. My name's John Bosworth, and we're looking at some of the possible causes of ADHD in children.